September 23rd. Uh, today I'm going to be going to Winnipeg to uh, pick up some drumstick materials and take all of you to the stores that I go to. So let's go. some petro some gasoline don't want to run out of gas like uh, somebody I know that ran out of gas on the road on the way to the Apollo last weekend <laughs> you know you my are. lottery ticket so if I win free drumsticks for everybody Winnipeg is <laughs> about two hours from where I live and uh, two hours one way and that's how far I gotta go when I go uh, pick up my materials it's one of the reasons why I always ask for a full price, full amount up front when I take orders. Because it cost me about, I'd say 80 bucks there and back, gas, something like that, maybe more. But yeah, it's kind of far. I live in Kenora and we don't really have much here. lately for, for orders. It's like every time I finish two, three orders, another two or three come in. I'm not complaining, but... It's, it's uh keeps me out of trouble um i always got something to do you know always working being creative good news uh the other day um the drum group i sing with is uh, we're, uh is young bear um yeah the good news is that we won a nami uh native american music award or nama whatever <laughs> but yeah we won an award I just wanted to say uh, miigwetch for everybody that uh, that voted for us. Just about on the highway, so uh, wanna pick bound. downtown Winnipeg um, first stop is Warkovs check out some leather see what they got there's the uh, driving by the MTS Center this is where they used to have the Manitowabi Pow so I'm at Warkovs this is the place I go to here's the address Just spent about two hundred dollars here at Warkovs and got some some premium leather. I like to use this stuff for the handles. Oh yeah. So 
we're rolling in Winnipeg. Here's the freight house. Used to hang out there when I was a kid. They always had an open gym, ice rink for us to skate. This is where I used to go to school. Right there. Once upon a time. And we are now heading to the north end. North side. This is where I get all my tape for uh, anybody wondering uh, where I buy my tape to do my tape work, all my colors. So this is the company I go through. I have an account here. But look them up, um, look them up through the internet and you can order your stuff online, all your colors. So this is the place. I don't need to go here today. I'm just, I just wanted to stop here and show everybody. I'm in the Polo Park area, and this is where I'm going. Hopefully they still got some rods left. Hopefully Tyler didn't uh, buy them all out. <laughs> and I need electrical tape. Here's the electrical tape that I use. Five dollars for like a six pack. Here's the rods. So I only need one container today. And this is where I get my white uh, fluff from. When I make fluffy sticks, IKEA. It's in the they're in the rug area, so that's where I go. But I got enough right now, so I don't need to stop there. This is the pre that I got from GNC. Try this out. Anybody ever try this before? If it's good, let me Little know. Walmart. Rocking the sevens, French blues. That's what I use for uh, drumstick fluffies for the heads underneath. Cut it into strips. The yarn I use for the heads on the drumsticks, for the leather drumsticks. Nice big bag, Ten, $10.37. I could probably make about four sets this out of this. The board I use to uh, package my sticks up when I send out a set of sticks, I use this bristle board. And here's the duct tape. I use this brand, and I use this stuff. Just picked up some lunch, and back on the road, heading back to Ontario. So I got to gas up next, and made it back to Kenora, uh, back from Winnipeg. It was about a two-hour ride. Picked up all my materials, everything that I needed today. I uh, this uh, re uh, video with a little review of some work that I've been, some fluffies that I've been working on. I got the TBZ on today. But yeah, so here we go. it for this video um, next vlog will be I'm thinking next week I'll be doing uh, how to make a drumstick 
from scratch so I'll be doing all the steps and um, just wanted to say also we our new Young Bear CD is out too our brand new one we recorded at Manitowabi that's out so hit up any one of our boys we all got the CDs I don't got mine yet I should have mine in about a week uh, so that's everything uh, hope everybody has a good week or weekend later